Did you know that famous 1971 ultra-violent movie, A Clockwork Orange? I've told for now it was love. You mo- Well, did you know that the author of the book the movie was based on was a school teacher in Malaysia? Although Anthony Burgess composed over 250 musical works and always considered himself as much a composer as an author, he is best known for the novel A Clockwork Orange, which he wrote in 1962. It was adapted into the highly controversial film by Stanley Kubrick in 1971, and the rest is history. Except that A Clockwork Orange might not have happened if Burgess didn't come to Malaysia. In 1954, Burgess joined the British Colonial Service as a teacher and education officer in the Dan Malaya, initially stationed at Kuala Kangsa in Perak. He taught at the Malay College, now known as Malay College Kuala Kangsa, modeled on the English public school lines. During his time in Malaya, Burgess devoted some time to creative writing and published his first novels. Time for a Tiger, The Enemy in the Blanket, and bats in the east. These became known as the Malayan Trilogy and were later published in one volume as The Long Day Waits. We follow the protagonist, Victor Crab, a history teacher at an elite school modeled after MCKK in post-war Malaya. The story tracks his professional difficulties, his marriage problems, and his attempt to do his duty in the war against the insurgents. In the Malayan Trilogy, Burgess satirizes the dark days of colonialism and detailed a fictional exploration of the effects of the Malayan emergency and Britain's final withdrawal from Southeast Asia. Why this urge to record Malaya in fiction? Surely it had been done before. One could say, Burgess started writing professionally in Malaya drawing inspiration from his new surroundings and without moving to this country and releasing the Malayan Trilogy, he might have never developed his sharp sense of wit and satire in his writing. <laughs>